Little woman has been fed, spoon-fed oppression day after day after day after What's up you lovely people? Welcome to the channel. We got big news here. Yes, the Johnny Depp hater, that big hater, it's been fired. You remember the guy that was cheering the fact that the son won the defamation lawsuit against Johnny Depp when he was called a wife something, right? That certain person took the side of AH and also twisted the knife into the wounds when Johnny lost the case, right? Reclaiming what those headlines uh, stated, which aren't true. And also we know by now what happened. But anyway, this whole case here is about Watton being fired by GB and Mail Online because of uh, Lawrence Fox being on his show insulting Eva Ava Evans, which you often see this woman on uh, Pierce Morgan's show, a uh, super feminist. Incel. That little woman has been fed, spoon fed oppression day after day after day after day, starting with the lie of the gender. Uh, uh. <laughs> what? I have to say, he might have a point there about spoon-fed oppression forever. That's how it feels if you listen to the person. But that doesn't mean you have to use the derogatory term to refer to her. Aaron Fox shared uh, an exchange of messages in regard of those comments that he made on the show. And apparently they're supposed to be connected. Making you giggle is my weekly joy. Then you got a lot of crying emoji. You can imagine them freaking out in the gallery. So much fun, kisses, kisses. And then that Watton replied to this. I want to reiterate my regret over last night's exchange with Lawrence on GB News. Having looked at the footage, I can see how inappropriate my reaction to this, to his totally unacceptable remark appears to be and want to be clear that I was in no way amused by the comments. Lauren Fox has shared the private message conversation between himself and Dan Wooten where they laugh and joke about this contribution. Mr. Wooten shares several crying with laughter emojis which strongly indicate that he was indeed amused by Mr. Fox's contribution. The show, the TV channel received 7,300 complaints about the episode tonight with Dan Wooten. A spokesperson for TMG Media, the parent company of Mail Online, said following events this week, DMG Media can confirm that Dan Watton freelance column with Mail Online, which had already been paused, has now been terminated along with his contract. So, honestly, I don't think a lot of people are gonna be <laughs> disappointed about this or unhappy. Matter of fact, many Johnny Depp fans, including me, and also other people, they're gonna go, hey, maybe that's karma. He was this seems like to me also a little bit pressuring the fact coming from the fact that also Russell Brand is being investigated so I wonder if there is something to do there as well that uh, the, the V station are trying to look like hey, you know doesn't matter if you're part of the clan or not part of the gang you know we, we we're gonna do what it's right and so they've been pressured to act more quickly on this whole Dan Watton situation. A lot of people are happy. Let me know your thoughts on this. I think in a sense Johnny Depp is being vindicated to some extent because they really enjoyed um, twisting in the wounds, right? When Johnny Depp was down. Anyway guys, please consider subscribing. Thank you so much for your support as always.